Once upon a time, my mom made me sit down and read a stupid book. I was reading the boring words when all of a sudden this unicorn came into the room and said, Hi, my name is Riff. Do you want to go on an adventure? I said, yes, adventures are more fun than reading. So he flew out of my house. We were way up in the sky and then a bird pooped on my head. Ew. When we landed, we were wearing these funny hats and there were some kids sitting on the ground playing with twigs. Why are these kids so sad? I asked Riff. Riff told me that some kids can't afford nice things like books, so they have to play with twigs. I did not like this at all. So I walked up to this big rich lady and said, Hey lady, why are you buying all of these books for yourself when you can give them to those nice kids over there with the twigs? She bought them some books and they got so happy. Riff and I flew away to our next adventure. We got down to the ground again and we had these hairy feet. There were a bunch of people staring at this dragon and they all had weird eyes. What's wrong with these people? I asked Riff. Riff said, they lost their motivation to read. So now Telly, the dragon, has hypnotized them. I looked at the dragon and I walked right up to him and turned off his power switch. Then all of a sudden, all the people were back to normal again. Riff said to them, you know what's more fun than watching moving pictures? Using your imagination to make your own by reading a book. All of the people walked into the library and they were so happy. We flew into this shack and when we got inside there was this man with a long beard. It smelled really bad in there. We sat at his circle table and he made us look at this ball. My girl, he said, I am a time-traveling wizard and can see that your actions have done great things. Remember that lady who gave those kids the books? Well, in the future, she gets all the books her friends don't want anymore and gives them to all of the kids in the village who don't have books. And remember the townsfolk you saved? One of them now travels all over the land teaching kids how to read. Riff looked at me and said, You help these people do great things because you help them see the value of books. When I blinked, I was back in my house. My mom came up to me and asked me if I wanted to watch TV. I looked at her and said, No, Mom, reading is fun. Then Mom turned around and said, Reading isn't just fun, it's fundamental. 